Okay, so I met up with Apex and we uh, came on the Tim Gaming server and uh, we both, oh. yeah. We, we think that's all we have to say. <laughs> Basically, the server is. Uh, got problems now at 666. So if you own TimGaming.net, uh, we're really <laughs> sorry. Uh, he spawned his battle star, I spawned the hailstorm, um, and we had some serious space folding going on. There was actually this point in space where if you reached it, it would just your frame rate would reach zero. Yeah, and also it killed my main character. I can't log in with my character anymore. I just get insane frame rate. So this faction base is now in inaccessible and everything top to it is invulnerable. <laughs> so it's just there now. Uh, plenty of room to dock a really big ship as well if you manage to get in this faction. So something for the admin to do. Um, and I'm going to go and meet up with Apex now. Who is in the sun? Where am I? Uh oh, I've lost my camera. Quick. Oh, I can see you. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Um, it took out your core. Uh, I'll be right back. Hang on. Oh. I'm in. I'm in the sun. Hey. Oh, God. I've got to watch out. Right. Where's the MTX? There's the MTX. Right. I'm going up there. Hey, bail. Bail. Okay. I'm out. Oh, God. It's bright. Oh, God. It's bright. Look away. Oh, God. I'm going towards you. Yeah, I see my turret is going... Oh, God, it's getting... Interesting. I can't look anymore in that direction where you are. Yeah, oh, God. I see what you mean. It's right behind me. All right. So I'm here with Apex, and we're inside the sun. Oh, sure, I just accidentally looked at the sun. Chilling. Oh, the sun's behind you. Yeah, the sun's behind me, so it's a bit crazy. I'm just trying to see. We're just uh, letting... This... We're giving an offering... <laughs> <laughs> Our sacrifice. Our sacrifice to the star. Do you know the like ship that we used to try to save the server. Yeah. It did its job well, though, didn't it? Oh, yeah. I punched right through my battle star. And hailstorm as well. Oh, yeah. Do you know what? Well, yeah. It's taken longer than I thought it would. Oh, to take, the, take out the MPX? Yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, big ships survive very well in the sun. It's, yeah, my surfboard, I died before I even got here. Oh, that thunder turret that I brought here has it's just still died. There? No, it's died. Oh, really? huh. Core overheating. I'm going to hide in the canopy of the MTX away from the sun. Yeah. It's nice here. Nice and shaded. <laughs> Somehow, in the sun. Just in here. We'll have to find somewhere more stable to do our battles. You mean like your dedicated server when it eventually it goes back. back? Yeah, exactly. When we go ah, to the server, that, was, that was terrible. Yeah. Things we did not go as planned. We should have recorded the death of this server. Yeah. Uh, would have been great. I know, I know, but you never know when these things... Because that's the thing. We were just trying to get set up. <laughs> and then the server died. And then, and then it just all went horribly wrong. So, yeah, <laughs> we just have to do it again sometime, for sure. For sure, man. Do, do, right, do, yeah. do, do, do. It's so funny. Whenever I come into this cockpit now, it feels really constricted because I made it bigger in a later, oh, in a later version. Yeah, yeah, the Hailstorm had the upgraded one. My Battlestar, when you eventually get to see it, has a nice, spacious little CIC. Oh, yeah. So that's, that works for me. So, yeah, so I got to see his Battlestar from about, I don't know... Five seconds? Yeah, about, what, what about that? I was about 100? No. More like 300 meters away? <laughs> And then the server died. Yeah, because... like if I got anywhere near it, then the frame rate would drop. <laughs> we had to kill it from long range. <laughs> it was a bit sad because it never really had a chance, you know? Yeah. But, I mean, you see what I mean when I said it takes. You really need to kill that fucking Yeah, yeah, thing. it did take a lot of uh, damage to get the shields down. But then I, yeah. I was aiming at the wrong thing as well. I was aiming at your. Uh, 
She was aiming at a ship core docked in one of the flight pods. <laughs> so we thought it was just so powerful, it was unkillable. <laughs> and we were like, it won't die. And then I was like, oh, it's not the core. <laughs> Classic. Oh, Christ. It'd be great if you could just make sort of mother ships in this game. Oh, yeah. I do think that docking big ships could be easier. Yeah, I think they should get rid of the whole docking enhancer things. Because, you know, I mean, if they got rid of that, you would be able to dock big ships to tugs. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, it's not... You don't see big things just sticking out of the space station so the shuttle can dock to it. Yeah, because that's the other thing as well. Because if you make the area big enough to dock, and sometimes it'll all glitch out anyway. Cause it'll yeah. Just sort of, it'll just sort of dock in a funny way, and it'll be sticking through walls anyway. I think it would be good if you could just, you know, dock ships to docking uh, points. Yeah. Rather than have to deal with all this crap with enhancers. Yeah. You know, oh, the the enhancer docking square thing is intersecting with the hull of the ship. Let's just make it so it's deactivated. Yeah. Or you can just make it so if a ship can fit in there, it can dock. And I think that would be the better alternative, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, man. So how's this thing ended uh, by the light? Or and look at it in build mode. Oh, shit. Do you know, I'm going to have to edit oh, that out, because right. it's just, like, white screen. Oh, fuck, it hurts my eyes every yeah. time. I'm just walking backwards, because... Look at that, uh, so it hasn't even got through... This thing's just solid, man. It hasn't even got yeah. through hardly any of it. The more, basically... Oh god, dude, jump into the ship core here, and go into build mode. Look at the mass of the ship dropping. Really? Oh, okay. So it's <laughs> it's just huge. <laughs> the mass is dropping at uh, <laughs> two a second, so it's taking out twenty blocks a second. That's quite a lot. Well, this thing has a mass of thirteen thousand. My battle star has a mass of like seventy odd thousand. Mm. My battle star would you would last a while in here. So that. All right. Also, if you look at the front of it, there's a thing sticking out that shows you where it used to be. Like a progress bar on the ship's destruction. What? I don't see that. Really? Where's that? Hey, look at it side on. There's some black hull bit sticking out. Oh, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's where it was. Yeah, so that's how far it's managed to get. Yeah, I mean, once this block is gone, it's just going to... It's not going to take long. The hull. Yeah. So looking at it yeah. going down, wow, it's going down really fast. I think I underestimated how fast it was going down. It looks like three or four seconds, really. <laughs> it's actually really fast. Oh, yeah, um, on my video about um, players being able to walk around in the sun, Skema actually gave me a little uh, teaser... Oh, so yeah. it's, he's actually going. He's actually working on a system where ships can survive fully in the sun, but it would have to be a specialized thing like cloaking ships. Okay. Yeah. So you know how cloaking ships need to be specially designed. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's going to be like that where you have to specially design a ship to be able to survive in the sun. Huh. Yeah, I think he's planning like a special kind of shield, maybe. Oh, right, yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, so, you know, you have to keep your ship's power up for it to work. Ah. Uh, yeah. Energized shielding, something. Yeah. Keep in mind, that we're going to start big ships like that, is just coming in and taking out a couple power blocks. Yeah. And then their whole thing just melts. Yeah, yeah, then none of it works, exactly. I mean, it's the same with cloaking ships. The instant you get a single shot off on those things, they're done. Yeah, you always want to make a pretty one, don't you? But it just doesn't work. Cause because it has to be all power blocks in a certain matter. Yeah. I mean, it, he, he could go a little easier on it, just so we can make prettier cloaking ships. 
I mean, to the point where they'd still have to be specialized, but not so far that it's just these big, ugly things. Oh my god, this thing's just melting. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'm sure I'll be seeing Apex again soon. Um, Definitely. And um, go and watch his videos too, if you don't already. Yeah. Um, most of you, I'm sure, do. But uh, if you didn't know, the link will be in the description. So, thanks again, and I'll see you next time. Bye.